Hello, this is uh, Corbin, and I am going over how to create a Chronicles of Darkness game in Roll20. Um, as you can see, this is the uh, home screen that you start off with in Roll20. All you have to do is click the Create New Game button up here. It will load, and you can give your name, your game, whatever name you want. Uh, usually, if you're doing something like Vampire or something, you can give it a name with By Night at the end of it usually like Boston by night. And uh, so you could just create a game like that with just the name and throw in any tags if you want. This is mostly for people searching for public games, but if you're making a private game, you can ignore this. Um, but you want to look for a character, sh the particular character sheet for what you want to play. You want to look for Changeling the Lost. Oh look, you can only find it down here under Storyteller System. It's odd that it's the first edition, but what if you're looking for the second edition one? Well, here's what you do. You go, instead of looking for Changeling the Lost, look for Chronicles of Darkness by Roll20. You can also do the uh, Chronicles of Darkness not by Roll20, which is the community character sheet. Um, the community character sheet has a little bit more options than the Roll21, but I like the Roll21, so I'm just going to cover that for right now. Select it. As you can see, it shows a Vampire the Requiem character sheet, but once we get into the game, launch game. If you look at the character sheets over here, add a character, give it a random name, whatever. If you look into the character sheets, it's not a Vampire the Requiem character sheet, it's a Chronicles of Darkness character sheet and it has health, willpower, morality. That's weird, but if you go here into the settings page, you can find that there's not just the first edition of Chronicles of Darkness, but the second edition of Chronicles of Darkness as well. So if you want to play Vampire the Requiem, you can select that, and it will show you a Vampire the Requiem character sheet with humanity and blood potency on the right, as well as Vitae. Um, you want to do a Werewolf the Forsaken, right here on the right, Harmony, Primal Urge, Essence, and Mage the Awakening, same thing, Gnosis Mana, Wisdom, I'm going to just skip to the one, to a couple other ones just to show you off, and it updates it however, which for whichever system you're using. I hope this was informative and that if you're looking to play a game of Chronicles of Darkness that this helps you find what you're looking for. Thank you so much and if you have any other questions about playing Chronicles of Darkness in Roll20, feel free to um, post a comment below and I'll get to that question as soon as I can. And Promethean Pilgrimage. Have a good one. Thank you for watching.